Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I am back with another video and this time I'm gonna be doing my toes. So it's really not time for a pedicure, but y'all like, look at this. Y'all, <laughs> I was in there picking at my polish. So they look a hot mess. I was supposed to be going to Miami and I was gonna wait until then to do my toes, but my trip got canceled because of the Rona. Um, so I'm gonna be doing that today. So um, I'm the, well, let me see. Yeah, the polish that I have on my toes right now is regular polish. So I'm just gonna go in with some acetone and cotton balm and I'm gonna remove the polish. So, when you're removing polish, what you wanna do is just sit the cotton ball on your toe and just let it sit there for a few seconds. And it's gonna soak, like basically soak, you know, the regular nail polish. So when you're removing polish, what you wanna do is just sit the cotton ball on your toe and just let it sit there for a few seconds. And it's gonna soak, like basically soak you know the regular nail polish and it's gonna make it a lot easier to take off instead of you going in and rubbing 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 so again just sit it for a few seconds and then as you can see it comes right off and i always use regular nail polish on my toes um and it stays on really good <laughs> this polish i don't even want to let i don't even want to tell you how long this polish been on my toes but just know that it's been on for a while i think it's been since i did my last pedicure video y'all it's been a while Okay, so next, I can either, I think I'm gonna trim some of my toes and then just shape up some of the other ones because I am gonna be doing a French tip on my toes. Um, so I don't wanna, you know, keep them, I don't wanna do them too short, but they are pretty long. Alrighty, so after I trim my toes down, I'm gonna go in with a hand file and I'm just gonna shape them up. And I like my toes really, really squared. So I'm gonna go in there at a 90 degree angle and just going back and forth to get them as straight as I can or as squared as I can. Already just like that and then after I finish shaping up my toes I'm gonna go in with a cuticle pusher and I'm just gonna push back my cuticles and then I'm gonna go in and get rid of any dead skin from around my toes and like I said, like my the bottom of my feet is not rough or anything. That's usually how I know it's time for a pedicure. Um, so I'm just gonna basically do like a dry pedicure. And honestly, I just didn't feel like doing a full blown out pedicure. That's really what it was. Um, but yeah, so after I get rid of that, I'm just gonna go in with a buffer and just gently remove the shine from the natural um, nail bed. All 
Alrighty, so after we finish buffing these toenails, I'm gonna go in with an alcohol wipe and I'm gonna go ahead and just wipe my toenail off, or toenails off. After that, I'm gonna go in with my base coat and I'm using this one. And I'm just gonna do a thin coat on all of my toes. Just like that. So now I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing on the other foot. So again, we're either gonna trim them or just shake them up and then we're going to push back the cuticles and buff the nails and then wipe them off. Alrighty, so next I'm gonna be using this white polish by Kuki, and they are gonna be, I actually just received one of their PR packages, and they actually are gonna start selling these at Sally's, so if you're interested, be sure to go check them out, and I'll be sure to leave down uh, the link down below. <laughs> but next I'm gonna go in, and I'm just gonna do again the French tip. So with the same polish, I'm just gonna go in and outline the tip and then of course I'm gonna come back in and clean up the small line so to clean up my small line I'm gonna be using this um, number eight present um, nail brush cleanup brush and I got it on Amazon so what you want to do is just dip it into your acetone and just go in there from one end all the way over to the other. Just like that and of course clean up the sides. And then same thing on the rest.
Alrighty, so we did all of the toes. So now I'm gonna go ahead and just outline them again and just basically a second coat. Alrighty, so we're gonna go ahead and let that one dry. And then we're gonna do the same thing on the other foot. Alrighty, so we did the two coats on both feet. So now I'm gonna go ahead and do the top coat and I'm gonna be using this one. And these, um, the top coat and the base coat I got on Amazon. So I'll be sure to leave the link down below. But I just love how shiny and then how fast this top coat uh, actually dries. And actually this is the same brand that I used to use before I actually started using um, gel polish. I was using um, this top coat on all of my nails. Alrighty y'all, so here is the final look. Excuse the cut on my toes, but as you can see, they turned out really pretty, really shiny, and it was really quick and simple. So as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at GetNo32, and I will see you guys next time.